TV10 and WRNR proud to bring you this episode of Law Enforcement Live, recorded on the 9th of November, 2020. Thank you to the Berkeley County Sheriff's Department for allowing us to give you this look into a day in the life of a law enforcement officer. This episode will feature a vehicle unlock, investigation into possible terrorism, and a vehicle accident. Law Enforcement Live is filmed live with the men and women of law enforcement. All participants in tonight's show are innocent until proven guilty in a court of law. Viewer discretion is advised. Registration number is what's on the uh, plate, okay? The license plate on the back? Mm -hmm. All right, gotcha. Some people right. some people don't know that, so. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Unlocked a uh, van like this before, so it should be a challenge. Are we working here? Thank you for coming. Uh, Amy, that was 8.5. Yep, you have your ID on this. I do. Okay. Can you show me your license plate? Take the blood pressure. Yep. <laughs> Huh? Are you trying for like the button to switch it? 
Yeah. Sometimes that works, sometimes it does. Awesome. Berkeley to 158. Go ahead. Railroad track crossing and the creek. Great. Sorry, Thank you. Okay. Oh, there we go. Carbon device is a silver or white sedan. Has been sitting on the side of the road for a few days. Caller believes it may be stolen, possibly, or related to the mailbox bombing that occurred on Grapevine Road. Alrighty. Thank you. You're very welcome. I do appreciate you guys. Yeah. Alright, you have a good one. 150 over 100, that's definitely hypertension. That van was stressed. Eastbound. They did it near where they're cutting out all the trees. And all the fears are not in there. Oh, no. What? My keys. Uh -oh. I, I had to walk them in Dollar Tree, but I've been in there like five times and no one's turned them in. But I really, I was hoping I left them in there, but I think I did because I've been able to always use my remote to lock my car. Right. So that I don't lock my keys in. <coughs> Excuse me. But I've been in Dollar Tree like five times and they don't have them in there. Yeah. I don't know where else they're going to No, that's the only one I went with Dollar Tree. <laughs> Sorry. Excuse me. Yeah. Okay. I'll get back in again, I guess. Uh, do you have a shopping cart? You, you, uh, how about a basket? No, I just I bought what I got and I carried it in my hands. I never got a cart or a basket, either one. And I typically don't go to Dollar Tree anymore. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
I'm gonna have my husband bring me a key to bring me. Okay. Yeah. He, do you have a phone that you can call him or anything? Yeah, he can't come and get me until like 3 o'clock. But, okay. but he's, he's gonna bring me keys. You okay. just have a chance to find keys. Yeah. Okay. They've gotta be in this store. This is the only store I've been in. What the. What? He's just what helping me look for my keys. Is yeah, I'm just helping out for our keys. keys. I mean, if you if you want to, if you want to review it. Is that what he's doing? Yeah, he's with me. Yeah, he's with me. He's good. So. And he's just helped me find my keys. Thank you, guys. Sure. Yeah, I can. Where you say again? On in Martinsburg. Randolph Street. Okay. Yeah, I can run you over there. Thank you. I think we had lots of in legitimately this time, then. What was the manager saying? Did they need, they need to be, be notified notified? when you're filming. Yeah, something. Uh, Newsflash, but I got a body camera on, so. <laughs> I know. Oh, What was it? Uh, possibly. Okay. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, I forget her name, but yeah, I remember it now. Yep. Gotcha. <clears throat> One fifty-eight Berkeley. One fifty-eight. Go ahead. Hey, one more time. I'm I'm terribly sorry. Where, what road was it in Martinsburg? Okay. The vehicle was unlocked. The vehicle owner advised that she may have lost her key. I'll be giving her a ride to three zero three Randolph Street, Martinsburg. <clears throat> I'm just going to be 10016. Yeah, 0 0016. 135, go ahead. Just to understand, this vehicle will give me an area of the creek access. <clears throat> I'll be near Flag Crossing, the train crossing drive. Right, we east or west of Grapevine. Always amazed people that freak out because I'm there. Between yeah. Grapevine Road, it's Cemetery like, Road, West of Grapevine. I was filming on my cell phone, but would never yeah. notice, you right. know what I mean? But just because yeah. I have a professional camera and I think it's just the rest of the freak out. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> It's a public place, you know? Everybody just wants something to complain about. Very simple. Do they hot for long sleeves or not? Oh, yeah. Hey, you want to guide me to Randolph Street? You said race? Yeah. There you go. Try one more time. Okay, yeah. Yep. Okay, okay. Gotcha. I know. I know where we're at now. Gotcha.
this road now. They, they just repaved all this. A lot of it's nicer. Yeah. Most of, I think they did most of Queen Street. <coughs> Excuse me. It's part of Winchester down to Sheridan. A nice portion of King. So, it's come along pretty nice. available for a welfare check on the L lane in the uh, in the area of Hammond Hill Road. There is the 81 northbound on ramp. I'm being burnt. I checked on him earlier. All right, by her, can get. Happy 117. Lane near the northbound on ramp for the 20 mail lane in the grass. Okay, we'll turn again. Happy 117. <laughs> Whatever, man. <laughs> Who am I to judge? Oh, you ever see that the, the uh, I'm sure there's a bunch of them out there now. It's called a YouTube video called These Are the People of Walmart. Yeah, yeah. you've seen it? Yeah. <laughs> Yeah. Yeah, they got some good ones at the Marts River. Yeah. <laughs> One of those videos claims we have the worst Walmart in the country. Martinsburg? Uh-huh. Oh, wow. It's just because it's West Virginia, that's all. Yeah. That's what I was going to say. I don't, I don't know if it's true or not, but I also wouldn't doubt it. <laughs> yeah. Big swing set on the right. Where's Copy there? 35. Oh, right here. Right here? Yeah. All right. Freeze your in three. The package. Yeah. GPS, you've arrived. <laughs> All right. Put you know the meter's been running. All right. <laughs> Thank you. I appreciate you guys. Perfect. Way to 117. Check your status. You're welcome. I'm trying to I'd, uh, follow up with all 117. Secure. Go ahead. Three mail check on our He's turned four. Trying to. There's a mattress store beside it, yeah. and there's a tanning salon. Maybe somebody talked to the key owner and within one of them, them, so maybe call them, them, them as well. Yeah. So, okay. Yep. Thank Alrighty. you. Yep. Appreciate You're welcome. It. Have a good day. I'm a little bit. I'll, I'll wait till you know it's only. Okay. Fire damage hmm. called Blue Ridge Property Restore. Yeah. 
South Walmart for 28 West Virginia to P. Papa, Paul Romeo at 862, Grand Colony Hill. Uh, yeah, I'll be having a statement. Okay, for a head expired June of 2019. <laughs> oh, damn. Someone's a painter. Copy one fifty eight. Cali 117, caller advised it was a beige passenger car, Burgundy El Camino. Have you seen the medic yet? You talked to him? Yeah. You got yourself checked out? All right. Yeah, you have your license, your registration, and insurance? I do not have operators. My, uh, you don't have one at all, or? I never had one. It's my daughter's vehicle. Okay. Do you have any time? Okay, you, you, yeah. have, you do have one in there. I had right. to go to work today. I work for Terry Hess, SPB Food. And I had to work today, so I had to take a Hey, you care who tows it? Here, come over here on the road.
That's what we're trying to do right now. Stay on the road, all right? I'm gonna pull my vehicle off the road, that way people can drive through here. Mm -hmm. Waiting. Tommy warns a negative for Timothy Crawford. Yeah. Did they put it up 
can I, would I be able to get some of his belongings or tools? It'd probably be best if you just go to the, the tow lot, let him, let him get his hooks up and everything, and then follow him to the tow lot and get everything out of there. He's good, he's, you should have to take him to the hospital. I mean, he's bleeding from his head. He's complaining of shoulder and neck and back pain. I mean, I don't even know, I don't know why he refused medics to begin with, but I mean, I can't, we can't make it a go, but. back in the road.